Yo, hello everyone! Are you looking for an easy way to connect with your team or clients online in 2023? In this video, we will show you how to start using Adobe Connect for beginners. From setting up your account to creating and managing virtual meetings, learn how to use Adobe Connect to collaborate, share content, and communicate effectively. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. The first thing, and as always, I will need you guys to go ahead and launch your browser. Right after that, go to the URL section and search for Adobe Connect. Let's do that. So Adobe Connect, and here we go. So let's just make this in English real quick, and here it is. Now, all you need to do is simply connect your account or try it for free. So, for example, here you can just go to this button, which is free 3T day trial, click on it, and it will take you. Here, you'll have to answer some of their questions. For example, do we here put your first mail, here, email I mean, here your first name, last name, your phone number, organization name, and here your country, the zip code, and your region, and some kind of like, essentially, uh, the basic information that they will need about you. So, we can go through them one by one. So, here I'm going to put my email, so let's do that. Here it is. Uh, they, um, I had like, by default, when I type my email some information will be written uh, here you just have to put your phone number uh, it has to be a valid one here your organization name you can put for example here tutorial just for the sake of this video here the country which is gonna be United States um, let's make it spin actually all right here we go here choose your region so you can choose um, rest of the world uh, time zone we can choose whatever so we can choose for example Madrid if we can find it um, we have to go down below but anyway you can choose the correct answers for yourself for me I'm just gonna choose the correct for myself and by the end you have to have everything correctly done so I'm just gonna choose for example this one for now and when you finish with that just click in here and choose, of course, your trial. So there is Adobe Connect Learning, Meeting, and Webinar. So here, if you'd like to buy, you can click here to buy now. And from here, you will find like the different kind of features that each one of them has. So before you get actually to choose, you have to see the features. So for example, here for Adobe Connect Meeting, uh, it's to know the inclusive visits, you can buy the guide here. So here, Meeting holds 25 person so for $15 per month so you can hold a meeting with up to 25 participants for the other one which is the Adobe Connect web uh, webinars it has webinar manager for 100 participants for 130 bucks you have 500 participants for 470 and a thousand for uh, 8500 so uh, I mean 5800 so these are the prices that you can go for and for the Adobe Connect Learning you will have virtual classroom manager for 200 person for about $370 per month so you can choose whatever you'd like from these it's all up to you and when you finish choosing it you can just go for example here meeting and I accept and sign up so it is for f the first 30 days for free so let me guys just answer all of these questions and go to the next step so meet you in a couple seconds so now as you can see guys I have filled the information randomly uh, just so I can show you this tutorial so now what I have to do is simply check my inbox for their own message so let's go to our email so here we go it can be over here so here it is and from here they will give us our username and password so just go to the link which is um, this one so here it is the account URL let's connect to it copy the email and the password here you can check remember username if you'd like to or you can just log in now just agree for their own um, uh, privacy policy and then click on accept 
and here it goes so this is the account this is the dashboard and how it looks like so for you to create a meeting you can just go here click on create and go to meeting right after that give it a name so tutorial name the actual like dashboard doesn't look like that much of good but it is useful so if you'd like to add like a custom URL, you can add it over here a summary for like a, a description about it the starting time the duration even select templates for your own uh, meeting here the language the access so registered users may enter the room account member may enter the room accepted guests may also enter the room or anyone who had the URL from the meeting can enter the room so it is all up to you to choose whether you'd like anyone or some people or some guests. So here, the enhanced audio video quality. From here, you can actually add uh, people to record the actual meeting or so just like uh, talk or something like that. So give host the option to anonymize recordings and hide entry screen for you if you'd like to hide the actual entry screen. Here, enable browser access. So for people to actually get access to your meeting, you will have to actually go through an application. For those who doesn't have an application, you can just give them this allow, uh, op allow them to, like to actually have the access through their browser. So they just they just have to connect to their Adobe account, and from there they can actually access to your meeting. And this one is enable mobile access. So it is the same as browser, just enable it from a mobile. Here for the audio conference. Uh, settings uh, do not include any audio conf conference with this meeting include this audio conference with this meeting so you actually can add like uh, an audio in the meeting itself you can just go to manage audio profiles and add an audio like it will be played in the background here include other audio conference with this meeting so conference numbers motorist code participant code you can everything if you actually did that you can actually add the codes here by your own yeah they will not generate them for you but you'll have to do everything by your own and remember guys this is just a beta form of how the actual adobe connect is going to be like in the future there might be some changes and some improvements of course finally here update information for any items linked to this item then click on next when you finish with all of that so here it is the meeting click on next Finally, here you can just click on finish and here it is the URL, here it is when it's going to start and here the duration of your meeting. If you'd like to enter the meeting room, you can just click on this link and as you can see the tutorial, here it is, um, you can turn on my microphone and enter the room right after that. So I can just allow it from here, just give it some couple time and it will connect you uh, briefly in that meeting and the same goes for other people it will launch the same as that so here it is you can actually share your screen from here uh, you can uh, add documents you can have a whiteboard where you can draw and explain things as you can see and all the participants will be in here uh, watching you doing and explaining what you are doing or whatever you are doing in here so yeah guys that was a brief about adobe connect i hope you like this video and see you guys in the next tutorial